Jack Frost takes a 3D animation adventure to save all that is good and nice in the world. Am I on the naughty list? <laughs> naughty list. Whoa. You hold the record. Happy holidays. I'm your host, Brett Martin. Thank you very much for watching the show. Santa Claus, the Easter Bunny, the Tooth Fairy, and the Sandman draft Jack Frost to be in their gang to guard against all things evil as they protect the magical state of childhood in Rise of the Guardians. I've been around for a long time. My name is Jack Frost. I love being on my own. No rules, no responsibility. It's as good as it sounds. Stars such as Alec Baldwin, Jude Law, Hugh Jackman, Chris Pine, and Isla Fisher lend their voices to this visually stunning film, perfect for the holiday season. Fellas. There he is, Jack Frost. Santa. Wow. What an adorable dream. What's more powerful? It's fear. We need your help. I'll be the first one to say that it's easy to be cynical about holiday movies, but this one won't let you. This certainly isn't a Judeo-Christian holiday-themed film, as you might imagine. And that's what makes it a better-than-average Christmas time movie. Turning these mythical beings into superheroes is clever. If it does well at the box office, I see a franchise in the making. The flickometer gives Rise of the Guardians a four out of five. This type of film has staying power for years and years with sequels and merchandising, and the movie studios like that kind of thing, and it would be childish to believe otherwise. Let me know what you think. Head on over to my Facebook page. It's called The Breath Side. Go over there and please click like. Oh, and you can also see all my reviews on my website. It's called flickedup.com. Head on over there right now and see hundreds of reviews just like this one. Go ahead, do it. I'm Brett Martin. Thanks for watching this review.